Kirby has been called one of America's best unknown guitarists. We're going to fix that today. He is Scotty Anderson, the person who's quite literally writing the book on Scotty Anderson, is here to help welcome him into the class of 24. Please welcome Rick Kennedy. You know, Chet Atkins once said about Scotty Anderson, he said, every time Scotty plays, I learn something. Now, now, Cal Collins put it a little different. He said, every time I hear Scotty Anderson play, I want to cut his hands off. <laughs> now, Lonnie Mack had a less violent solution. Every time Scotty was on the stage with Lonnie Mack, he just turned his amp off. So the question really becomes just who is this Scotty Anderson? Who is this fourth generation string player from the deep hills of Kentucky? You know, Dad Herschel played, Uncles Willard and Dillard played, Grandfather Virgil played. I didn't even get to the Troxels who are all part of this whole clan. So it's a long history. The best place to learn about Scotty really is on YouTube because there have been millions of visits to the different performances of Scotty throughout his career. And there's some from the 80s when he was a clinician with Yamaha guitar, right? Doing the, uh, you know, the large conventions for musical instrument shows and trading licks with George Benson and others. There's uh, the French television, public television recently just put up a new documentary of Scotty performing in the 90s with Marcel Dotti at the Guitar Festival in France. You can see excerpts of his Hot Licks videos. You can see excerpts of all of his great records, the J-Curve recordings. But the best thing are some of the local acts that he does, you know, is carrying on with the local clubs, because Scotty is fundamentally a local player. He's been around for 50 years, playing mostly in the loud honky-tonks in Northern Kentucky. To get a bigger sound, he developed what he calls triple stop. That's where you pluck three strings at once. It's not original, except it is to Scotty because he changes his finger configurations while he does it on the same song. Very unique, it's easier to watch than it is to explain. We're thrilled because Scotty is, uh, and Judy, his wife, have recently returned to the area. They had been down in the, the hills of Kentucky for a few years. He's back, Scotty's back doing his first love, which is teaching privately. It's what he, he enjoys doing. It's a joy to have him teach students, and it's a joy to induct him here today, introducing Scotty Anderson. Thank you. I can tell you this, he is nothing short of S. Scott Fitzgerald. <laughs> He's the greatest writer I've ever heard. And by the way, he told it exactly right. I'm not bragging, but that's the greatest man ever lived right there. <laughs> Alrighty, and here's the greatest woman I've ever oh, yeah. Everybody look at, look at this. How undeserving am I? Oh. Thanks everybody so much. Thank you all. I'm gonna try to play a few songs for you. I hope you can like some.
Thank you, gentlemen. At the risk of stating the obvious, everyone, I love jazz.